this eye, young Pablo Picasso. You are my canvas, and I will paint you beautifully today. What color should we run on this canvas today? Maybe a little bit of pinks and yellows, reds, blues. Yes, okay. Let's just dive right there. Okay. Two club of red here. color of black as well. What do you think canvas? What what color would you like to be painted? Okay. Hues of red, black, grey, different shades. are beautiful, beautiful, transparent mixing white, just for the canvas, just for the canvas. Pop the top and squirt like this. Beautiful. As you can see a yeah, beautiful shade of white, a little bit of red and some black. And uh, perhaps we even do a, a little blue color. a decision to make. This blue or this blue? This one? Okay. And maybe even a little bit of uh, pink, yellow, okay, we will do yellow instead. Yellow, yellow, beautiful color of yellow. You know, my favorite store is the Hobby Lobby, it's beautiful, many, 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 many beautiful colors of paint. my station around here. One second, por favor. And then I'll begin to frame you up. And maybe a little bit this way or this way. I think maybe Is the spot here. We have to make sure that we have clean brushes at all times. Very important. Very, very important indeed. 
these here, like so, and we'll clean these. Be very gentle with your brush, so that we are not to damage you. Cannot afford to damage. But if we do damage, we'll just cut it part of the art and it'll be worth even more, my friend. You see. Let us begin. too precise with this process. It is art after all and what I desire to be here on this canvas is what the art will be. So this looks good already. Beautiful yellow colors, beautiful yellow hue, okay. Go ahead and clean this brush. The secret to having a clean brush is cleaning the paint off while it's still wet. If you wait too long and it gets hard, then you have to use paint thinner, which can damage the brush. This is a tool, you see, a vessel to portray onto the canvas what is in my mind. So we must always treat our tools with utmost respect. Okay, so. I think a little bit of black here. Maybe in this. Maybe even a little bit of black, a little bit of black, a little bit of black over here in this area as well it will be very, very good for the art piece. So let's go ahead and make this happen. Okay, a little bit of right? Just a very little bit is all I need. Just very gentle. And as you can see, it's the perfect amount on the brush, like this, is all we need for you, okay. So, we put a little bit over here, like we said, right there, brush, 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 and a brush, brush. And a little bit over here. This art is shaping up very nice. The eyes, and the nose, the outline of the chin, the jawline. But this uh, quite abstract. It's uh, kind of how I feel today. You see, we're here in Spain, and it's already snow, snowing in Spain. So, what's the chances of this? Chances. Apologize for this. I'm sorry. Okay, so. Just right, right there. Good. Okay. Okay. Good spot right there, okay.
must always be very gentle with the brush again. Okay. Let us see. What color should we do now? Oh, yeah. We'll leave a little bit of white. But first, maybe a little bit of the blue. Yes, a little bit of contrast with the, uh, the blacks and the yellows. The blue comes in this side here. To really pop and create a contrast that the eye will naturally gravitate to. And maybe perhaps we move to the brow with a little bit of our red. Okay. as well over here is a very small portion that I must get out of on this side as well. Good. And precise. A precise stroke here. Good. And, uh, and then good. Okay. Oh boy. This shaping up very nice. I'm very proud of this one. This is coming together very well. We're almost done. Very, very good. Okay. brow like we discussed earlier maybe a little bit of red here to tie the face together create contrast both here and here for the eye to naturally focus in the middle and the gaze in the abstract the gaze is a uh, very important when you look upon the art piece and when you turn your head to the side and see it for the first time it has got to draw your attention to the center and then allow your mind to wander to the sides and explore the painting after this. But the center, my friend, is always where your attention must go. So, to do that, we will place a little bit of the red paint on top and the brow. And we will do this now. You can see the 
as you can see these very very sharp indeed on the very tip good and we will just we will just place these we will just place this above the brow here right there good and another spot is one more spot here in there and then I believe I believe once we've once we have uh, completed this brow here we put a little a little bit of emphasis on this here on the uh, left side right side of the canvas and the tissue to do wonders to draw the attention to the which it has done. I really like this painting. It is one of my favorites to date. <sighs> beautiful. You're just beautiful. Okay. I believe switch to the brush more fine fine tuned point on this one and we will uh, complete you the shade of white to uh, blend on the contour sides of the cheek for our blues and our yellows to soften up the face right here in the middle and then uh, once we do this we will be off to the races so come across the face gently come across the face like so good good and we come up like so and a couple more strokes here good and maybe mix a slight pink off to the side Yes, we will make this pink color here. And come here, here, here like this. Good. Just brush, brush, brush. Yes. Okay. I really like this. Okay. 
now I will not focus on the painting. I will clean my brush off, like so. And then we will move our attention to our breathing and approach the painting here with a new outlook from a perspective of someone who's not painted but is viewing the painting for the first time to get an organic idea of what it looks like to a viewer It is beautiful. It is. It is beautiful. It is done. Yes. My finest piece of work yet. Thank you for showing me the way. My dear friend, Mr. Canvas. Till next time. Goodbye.